Shri Guru Bhiyo Nama. Good morning viewers. In this video, we are going to see about the upcoming Saturn retrogression in transit. Saturn is going to retrograde back from Sadabhishta star to Dharmishta star, Pada 4 and 3. And the effect is going to be there for 4 months. The retrogression starts on 17th June 2023 and it ends at 4th number 2023. It's about 140 days. So we are going to see the predictions on this 140 days for all the zodiac. What is the impact of Saturn retrogression? Uh, generally, what do you mean by retrogression? Retrogression is like a process where uh, planet seems like moving back, but it is an illusion, but no planet is going to move backward. To understand this better, is imagine that you are traveling on a train. Your train is moving at a specific speed on a particular track. Parallel, you are seeing another train with the same speed. You find both uh, trains are moving the same direction, the same speed. In case, if your train is getting a over speed, when you look at the other train, you feel that the train is moving backward, but actually the train is moving in the forward direction. But imagination the perception looks like the train is moving in the backward direction this is what we call it as retrogression generally we don't consider much on retrogression process because when Saturn is placed in certain houses it will not have a much effect but only those houses where it is being a ruler or it exalts in a particular house it will have a slight impact on an individual or a school now we are going to see as a special case because Saturn is already being raised as a ruler at Aquarius it takes a moon trikon stand there and this time it is going to retrogate back from a star like Sadabhishta to Dharmishta but actually it is not moving back from Aquarius to Capricorn. The retrogression is taking place only at Aquarius. Because of this, what is going to happen for each and every zodiac? Already Aquarius is like a, a house which we determine for wind. So when Saturn moves in an anti-clockwise or a backward direction, the process is getting slowed down. The impact of Saturn is getting slowed down in the next 140 days. Assuming for Aries, the first house, Saturn is responsible for the 10th and 11th house. And at 11th house when it retrogates, because of its retrogation, the speed, it is getting back. Amount of revenue is getting reduced. To equalize or balance the revenue, the individual should work hard, put more effort to compensate the revenue back. So indirectly it forces you to put more energy to substantiate your wealth. So this is an example of the impact of retrogression. In certain aspects this retrogression is beneficial and for certain zodiac it gives certain problems also. So we are going to see a separate video for each and every zodiac the impact of the Saturn retrogression right from Aries to Pisces. If you are new to this channel Keep this subscribed so that you will get my updates instantly. Capricorn, the 10th zodiac sign. For Capricorn, Saturn holds responsible for the first and second houses and they are in the last leg of the second house period of Saturn. Saturn plays at the second house, getting retrograded at the second house will give some impact in terms of family life, in communication as well as in their personal wealth. Some will face certain problems and issues in the family matters in the next four months. Those who are working with communication as a base may face certain challenges and difficulties in the next four months. Those who are in sales market, Marketing. They face a lot of troubles and challenges. Even for lawyers, it looks very challenging because the cases they deal, they face a lot of issues and controversies. There won't be good respect for their speech. Even for teachers, students may not like the way the teacher, they don't show much interest in the studies. So, teachers need to be careful while communicating with their students. So the upcoming four months looks challenging for them. Even in family life and personal life, some may face certain controversies and issues. So whatever they speak, it will not be acceptable by others, due to which there will be some controversies in the family life. They don't get good income. There won't be good inflow of money in terms of business. So, there will be a dip in the wealth. Even those who are aspiring for a family life, they face certain challenges and difficulties. But it depends upon the individual chart. Generally, Saturn will not do much harm to the whole signs like Aquarius and Capricorn. But as a 700 hour period of Saturn is running now and Saturn is a bit slow in the second hour, it may show certain negative impacts also. Saturn is also responsible for the first hour, so indicates there may be some health related issue. But since Saturn retro and it is slow in the process. There won't be much health problem because even if they face any health related problem, it gets solved in the next four months. So there will be positivity also. Saturn is expecting the 4th house, 8th house and the 11th house. The 4th house indicate the properties they own. So in the next four months, it is difficult to acquire properties. Even if someone tries to purchase a land or a vehicle, they face certain problems, issues with the dealers. The vehicles if they purchase, they face certain maintenance problems frequently. Even if they buy any land, they will be disputed in the land. So, 
they should be careful in reading all the terms and conditions before purchasing so all the documents should be proper and well read before purchasing so it will be of good help for them fourth is also indicate mother and mother's health so some may face some issues and problems in the health of the mother But fortunately jupiter is getting associated with the fourth those so will not give much trouble even if they face any problems they find a good solution and remedy is immediate now saturn aspects the eighth house and jupiter also aspects the eighth house to an extent it is good because saturn power is less so some may get unexpected luck there will be some luck through lotteries or other gambling means some may even find some profits through social media or through investing in share market so it depends upon the individual chart the positivity may differ now saturn aspects the 11th house the retrograded saturn aspects the 11th house indicates profit so there may be some inflow of money to business and workplace but at the same time as the saturn is which slow in its process they may not get the money in time even if they record the profit in papers but actual in reality the money it will come very late even the employees may get salary late they won't find the amount in time so there may be some challenges also they face certain problems with the elders they won't be a good relationship with the elder brothers and sisters they face some consequences and issues with them some aspiring for the second marriage may face certain controversies and this is not so easy to get a second marriage in the upcoming four months so it looks challenging so when the saturn's actual transit took place in january for aquarius as well as for capricorn it looks good but in the retrograde saturn may give some challenge and hurdle for this zodiac